everybody. I'm Chris Beatty from Grow Talks Magazine. Ellen Wells, Green Profit Magazine. And uh, we're on day two of the California Pack Trials, and we are at GrowLink in Oxnard, California. And it's a darn big spot. It's a beautiful trial facility and where they've got that's like half a dozen different companies here. Seven? Seven companies. And we're going to check them all out for you. And the one we're going to start with is Plant Haven. Come with me, it's over here. And uh, we're going to take a look at a few different varieties that they have, starting with a new colocasia. Comes out of the Hawaiian breeding program they've been working with. These are beautiful, are they not? But here's the one we want to take a look at right around the corner. This is called Morning Dew. Variegated foliage. Variegated stems. For stretch and stems. even more important, the variegated stems. Can you get those, Jan? That's pretty cool. Striking plant. I asked why they named it Morning Dew, and it was in part for the sort of a dew drop pattern on the foliage. But Ellen, did you know Morning Dew is a traditional Hawaiian song? I had no idea. Well, if you didn't know, I'd have you sing it for us. <laughs> anyway, that's, uh, that's Morning Dew Colocasia. Uh, another new one in uh, really more in, in landscape type plants. This is a new abelia called Radiance. Variegated, quite obviously. But look at the nice habit on that, especially in a Beautiful. small pot. And that would look so nice in a mixed combo. You could grow this all summer long in a patio and then put it out in your landscape and get double duty out of it. And apparently there's a little bit of red color for, for fall. Very nice. Now Chris, this kind of looks like an echinacea, doesn't it? Uh, it kind of does. But it's not. This is Lucanthemum uh, Real, Real Glory actually, it's in the Real Series. And there are four um, new varieties in, the, in this series. In fact, if you pan over to the sign, we can show the other ones. Real Dream, Real Galaxy. This is the one you just saw, Real Glory. And then, here's a real neat one. What do you think it's called? Real Neat. Oh, that's a real neat name. All right, everybody loves Sedum because they're bulletproof, great fall color. Unfortunately, it's fall color, and this is spring. So this one, called Pizzazz, is not blooming. But again, they've got signage here that shows you what it would look like. And Gen Z, swing over this way. They've got some scented varieties here at Plant Haven, which is cool. And here's a nice one. This is uh, part of the Scent First series, and this one is called Dianthus Memories. And, uh, wow. Real sweet fragrance, and the neat thing is uh, a percentage of sales in the UK go to the Alzheimer's uh, right. uh, Association over there for research. So that's Dianthus Memories. There's also one called Pink Fizz, Pink Fizz that you can see here in the picture, and I love anything with a Z in it. That's very trendy. We saw uh, Pizzazz earlier, now Pink Fizz. Remember we saw that thing called Zazzle, Zazzle, Zazzle. yesterday? Mm -hmm. That was fun. I think if you put Z in a name, it automatically is going to sell because it's fun to say. Right, Zellen? <laughs> you could have called me Chris. And it would have been real funny. <laughs> she could have, but she didn't. 